Today was the Clear the Shelters event put on by the staff here at WTWO. We had members out in Illinois at the Edgar County Shelter, as well as here in Terre Haute at the Humane Society for much of today to help find a permanent home for these animals. Our Sack Stidham spoke with staff at the local Humane Society about their current needs. The Terre Haute Humane Society is currently way overbooked and they have over 200 dogs and over 100 cats. Their normal housing is around 78. This means they are having to shelter these dogs in places they would usually not want to. Maggie Wheeler is the volunteer coordinator at the Terre Haute Humane Society and she says this event can go a long way to help solve the overcrowding problem. We have some um, reduced adoption fees on adult dogs and cats, so that will be $20 for today and tomorrow. Um, um, and so we're just really encouraging people to explore adoption um, and give, you know, the homeless pets that we have here a second chance at a loving home. Saturn Pet Care is one of the primary sponsors this year. They have provided over 50 pallets of pet food for local shelters over the past year. Saturday they were giving out free pet food to anyone that decided to adopt a cat or dog of any kind. Ashley Natalie is the office manager at Saturn and she explains what they are doing to try to provide to Vigo County. We make pet food, so it's very important to us, the nutritional value of the food that we offer, um, anything that we provide for the shelters. Um, we're very fortunate to be able to donate food to all of the shelters, and we just really want to be a community partner. At the end of the day, the Humane Society wants these animals to find a loving home. The sight of seeing the happiness these adoptions are bringing to families is the best part of the day. The pay is those happy endings and so that that keeps us going um, and you know it keeps us going financially too obviously when we get animals adopted but yeah I mean the emotional payoff is like you know the best those discounted adoption fees will run through tomorrow the Humane Society is scheduled to break ground on a new veterinary clinic sometime in mid-September